Air quality alerts are in effect for portions of the Cooley region. These are mainly in effect, however, for our western communities until 9 p.m. tomorrow night. And that's because we're still dealing with some of that smoke from the Canadian wildfires uh, from the north. But this time it's affecting our western zones. And again, until 9 p.m., this goes into effect for the ozone pollution near the surface that is causing problems for those unhealthy conditions for those of you that fall into that sensitive group category. So make sure that you limit yourself outside here uh, over, you know, from today through tomorrow night as it will be a little bit uh, on the unhealthy side here for some of us out there and uh, make sure to stay inside as much as you can here as well. In the meantime, we're at 62 degrees with sunshine here in La Crosse. Visibility looking good for that morning commute to 10 miles in Eau Claire. 59 degrees with plenty of sunshine to work with. North northeast winds light at 5 miles an hour. Look at the temperatures across the area this morning, mainly into the 50s. Some spots into the low 60s here. Currently it's 59 in Winona. Good morning to you. High temperatures today are expected to rise into the 90s here today. So another hot and steamy day is in store across much of the area. 66 and sunny here by 7. We're up to 85 degrees and sunny skies by noon today. And then by 4 p.m., 92 under mostly sunny skies, 85 degrees and it's still sunny here. And of course, still very warm even as we wrap things up here as we head to about 8 o'clock this evening. Skies for the most part now are looking nice and quiet and overall pretty clear across much of the region here as well. You can see there's some showers and thunderstorms across the central plains. I'm monitoring that, but it doesn't look like it's going to make it here, make it this way anytime soon because it is expected to move very, very slowly, slowly. And as it does, so it probably will weaken here a little bit, but we do have rain chances in the forecast. I'll get to that in a second, but I do want to show you sky tracker though in the short term, and you can see that conditions will continue to remain very quiet throughout the day. Just a couple of passing clouds is to be expected by tonight. Still looking at mainly dry conditions as high pressure really continues to dominate our weather pattern by giving us these very similar conditions that we've been seeing these last few days, which is lots of sunshine and very warm temperatures for us to work with. And you can see that pattern doesn't really go anywhere here throughout the day tomorrow as well. As long as this upper level ridge of high pressure continues to dominate our weather pattern here across the central and midwestern United States, and you can see it's going to continue to pump in a lot of dry and hot air across much of our area through at least these next few days, lasting up to at least by Friday. However, there are some changes. I am watching this upper level low that's forecast to move in here that could give us some cooler conditions to work with and also give us a chance of rain chances as we head into this weekend Saturday night into Sunday to be more specific. We could be looking at some uh, beneficial rain here moving in across the area. So something that we'll be watching out for here over time.